Hi everyone, welcome back to Defense Limit Channel. The Tupolev PAKD Day is a Russian strategic bomber currently under development. Although specific details of its equipment and technology are not publicly known, the aircraft is expected to feature advanced avionics and weapon systems, possibly including advanced radar and electronic warfare capabilities, as well as long-range missiles and bombs. The PAKDA is also expected to incorporate advanced stealth technology to reduce radar detection and increase its survivability in modern air defense environments. Speed, the Tupolev PAKDA is expected to be a supersonic aircraft capable of reaching speeds of at least Mach 1.5, about 1,800 km a or 1,100 miles per hour or higher. The PAKDA is also expected to have a long range, enabling it to carry out strategic bombing missions at intercontinental distances. As a strategic bomber, it is expected to be able to carry a variety of conventional and nuclear bombs, as well as missiles, and deliver them to targets with precision. The PAKDA is also expected to have advanced stealth capabilities, which will allow it to penetrate modern air defenses and engage targets with minimal risk of detection and interception. The aircraft has been in development since the early 2010s and has undergone testing and evaluation, including flight tests. The Russian Ministry of Defense has indicated that it plans to start receiving the PAKDA in the mid-2020s, suggesting that production could start in the next few years. However, as with any advanced military aircraft, the PAKDA's production and deployment schedule is subject to change based on a variety of factors, including technological developments, funding, and geopolitical considerations. The development and production costs for such complex and sophisticated aircraft can be very high, with estimates for the PAKDA ranging from tens of billions of rubles to over 100 billion rubles, equivalent to several billion US dollars. However, like many military programs, the PAKDA's actual costs can change based on a variety of factors, including technological developments, production efficiency, and budget constraints.